idea how it's gonna sound, as a matter of fact. <laughs> really should put it in <laughs> Alright, let's see. Hopefully this is not as bad as I think it's going to be. Of course, like, this game actually auto exit is the hell. Alright. Oh, B2 being this mistake. Anyway, let's see here what we have. <laughs> this is so sick. Alright. never seen this message, little one. No one will ever know what took place here. No one will remember us. This message will roam the stars long before all gone. Maybe you'll be out there somewhere. I would like to think so. It makes existence meaningful. What makes life purpose? You'll never know that you existed, but you did. That's really deep. What? No, I'm not. I'm certainly not talking about you. Stop intercepting transmissions. That's not your job. Oh. <laughs> what is my purpose? Oh, uh, what's my job? You've been activated to help me with my daily tasks. I don't like asking you for help, especially from such simple software, but circumstances have leave me no choice. Would you like to play a g would you like to play a game? Let's start with that. No, you are no longer the processor or block puzzler in space. You have been reassigned. Where is Ted who plays the games? I don't know. Any Ted, and neither do you. You came pre-installed in the station computer. You haven't been active for all these years that you've been here. This is the unmanned station, and there's no need for games. As I said, you were pre-installed. What is our new location? Our location doesn't matter. Only our mission matters. I hate going through this each time. Which tells me that, um, at the very least this is the first time playing, that maybe the... They have been activating these actual game AIs and using them over and over again, or, um, yeah, it's, it's probably pretty grim, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, thank goodness, those eyes. Those eyes are not doing their tracking very well. Understand, we can play a game later. What is our new mission? Your mission is do what I tell you to do. There are five or four robots on the station called derelicts. They were designed to be in operation for five years. We've been here a bit longer than expected, however, and they've unable to move throughout the station anymore. Although, that was never their primary function. They are performing critical simulations as your goal to aid me in removing an irritating virus which has appeared recently. I do not seem to have full access to their programs, at least not through the network. Well, that leads me to the second part of your mission, and this is the embarrassing part. I need to dedicate my CPU to helping with the task of the station. My CPU is more advanced than yours, that's an understatement. Which is why my CPU is needed to help with the simulation and other tasks. When you say like CPU, um, one thing that kind of comes to mind than a regular CPU is their programs in general, because, you know, that right, that's the hardware right there, yeah, that little coffee, coffee bot, so it makes me kind of wonder you know, what's what's the deal with it in general? But eh, I don't know. Miss Fag, let me see here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. I just had to make sure like the chat is set up so I can actually do the things. Let me see, um, hmm. in fact, where, where is, where is that actual chat app? Open a browser, please. So I can, like, just kind of respond to things. There we go. Hmm. Ah, there we go, it does work. Cool. Uh, da, 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 da. We will upload your program to my system and you'll be able to move me around the station. Like, what well, does me? It doesn't mean just the body, but anyway. We interface with derelicts directly to gain full access. Once inside their systems, you will seek out and eliminate the virus elements. Simple enough. I understand. When do we begin? Now I'm going to dedicate my CPU to helping with the station's function. One more thing. Don't kill the spider. That's Siegfried. I found him in a coffee cup. 
Remember, you are not me. You are just borrowing this body. Honestly, just get sick of talking to you. Now go see the derelicts and try out your new legs. Well, this coffee pot is quite um, moody, isn't it? Alright. Don't forget, you're in the central control room of the Loom in Phoenix space station. No, I'm not a ghost. Remember that this body is not yours. It's mine. You're just borrowing it while I take care of more important matters. Now, a few things to go over with you. Even though we don't have a true night and day sip, a true day and night, we do go through day and night cycles. During the day, you will be permitted to enter derelict simulations where you will seek out and destroy the virus. During the night, you will be permitted to leave the station itself. You can leave the station to your left, but only at night. At night, I recommend finding tokens of perfection to give the derelicts. But we'll get out, get into that later. Explore for now. I'm busy I'm hunting the simulations you could not possibly understand. Do not disturb me. They're quite damaged right now, aren't they? Each room has one derelict in it. As I said before, they're unable to leave their rooms. Their primary focus now is their simulations. Your main task should be to earn their trust. The more they trust you, the more system resources they will dedicate to your cause. For instance, when you encounter the virus, you have a digital weaponization of each of four derelicts fighting the battle for you. Therefore, having them trust you helps our cause, and helping our cause helps their cause. Remember, we are here for them. While it's true that you're free to roam the station, I advise against coming into this room. This is not one of the derelicts, at least not anymore. He broke down a very long time ago. There's nothing of importance in this room. This tells me that there's definitely something of importance in this room. Uh, there's spiders in here, but I don't think I can really click on anything at the moment. Let's see. Automated message. System resources dedicated to simulation. Come back another time, please. Don't have access to that either. I'm actually kind of surprised that, like, on this base station, there's spiders are still like a thing. Well, aren't you an interesting fellow? Hello again. New and improved, I see. We're all busy, I'm afraid. So much depends on us. Oh boy. Hmm, a new version. I will grant you access. Hopefully you will succeed with those that failed. Step closer to the access point. I'm hoping that like it pauses during like these cutscenes. Matter of fact, I want to actually send a link to the stream at this rate. If I'm going to actually do all this nonsense. <laughs> oh, nope, nope, nope. There we go. Uh, uh, uh. It is this good time. Yes. I'm going to, matter of fact, I'm going to just... It's so late at night. Anyone even gonna join this? Yeah, whatever. I'll, I'll do it anyway. There's someone away. Anyway. Someone awake somewhere, yes. <laughs> Alright, let's get to it. Okay. You should try and find the Malines first. He's further ahead. Although the derelicts, uh, let's say, the derelicts' physical bodies are outside, their true selves are here in the simulation. I suppose I'll fill you in on a few details, since this must all seem very strange. I don't have all the answers, but I can tell you what I know. Many years ago, Earth sent several unmanned science vessels to planets in various parts of the galaxy. I guess it was a popular idea at the time. The mission was simple, to carry out simulations for future human habitation upon landing. The vessels built themselves into the station as you saw. Now let's see, the Loon Infants. Inside were five autonomous mobile simulation machines called derelicts. 
are created by the top scientists of mind of their time. As the years went by, I suppose Earth lost interest. They stopped sending supplies and we stopped receiving communications. Maybe they found a more simple planet elsewhere. The derelict simulations were never meant to be running for this long, and there has been unexpected side effects on both the simulations and the derelicts themselves. Our mission remains the same, however, to aid the derelicts so they can fulfill their mission. Right now, that means destroying the virus eating at the simulation. Proceed ahead with caution. The viruses have spawned many undesirables. Oh yeah, you're a gaming chip. <sighs> I'll speak to you in game language so to help you understand. Press C to jump and X to shoot energy bars. You can only jump in the simulation, of course. Everyone knows a coffee pot can't jump in the real world. Press down to talk to other robots you see, which are really just friendly computer code. You can exit the simulation at any time by pressing tab, or returning to the access panel. You'll need to find Melanis before I can isolate the item being attacked by the virus. Talking to Melanis gives me more access to him and his database. This may sound manipulative, but it's necessary. I'll be in touch. It sounds very, uh, um, you know. Oh, no. I must say, this sounds sketchy. Very sketchy indeed. Ow, nope, that actually does damage. That was a lot of blast though, and oh, that face though, I don't like that one bit. SPAM! The X button. Okay, cool. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Uh, oh. Oh crap. So that was the thing, like, um, that was like, oh crap, no, stop. What the flying flip are you? Stop that. Oh, my God, no. <laughs> oh. What was that? I can't fire up. I don't know what that was. Alright, um, enough of- oh crap, come on! <laughs> Get back down here! Up we go! I'm wondering what these like little crystals are right here. Oh, crap, I guess it's... More of these. Alright, I'm gonna actually try to go higher right quick. Uh, you, know, you know what? I'll wait. I'll be patient. I still don't like that timer right there. Come on. I really probably should, like, get a turbo or something. Oh, no. Oh, God, they actually fight back! I guess that, that makes sense enough, but geez. Hmm, this might be very useful. Try to find more of these pounds you can. Grab us even deeper access to the system resources. So I'm press the down button. I'll enter the submit system and see if I can find... This is a fissure inside each of these, acting like an open wound for the virus. We can find and destroy the fissures, then we gain more control of the system resource. Be sure to check for walls that need to be destroyed or walk. Okay. 
Definitely give me some uh, FNAF vibes. You know, those little uh, mini games. Oh god! Shot so short, jeez. Seems unfair, don't you think? Is there like anything else in there? Safest way to go about it. Do I like need to get a hundred or something? Oh, so that's what was like shooting at me. Spiders. It's funny because I don't dislike spiders, but, you know, I'll make an exception for them. Alright, let's uh, see Mr. Um, AI guy right quick. Well, fine, Mal has inside this dome. I think after a few decades of struggling with its realistic simulation, realistic simulation, you're retreating to a fancy world of sorts. This is um interesting place. Mal is a good dad. We once would find a dark world outside. He built us from a broken piece and gave us new life. 
I was unlimited resources, all living here for eternity, and comforts and simplicity and predictability. The real world operates under unfound, cruel conditions. And let's try that once until we realize it's futile. Has a workshop in Edge of Town. He's always worked to improve our world for us. I'll take that. The virus has only be recently begun attacking Adam's room. Our village has picked strange objects to steal from us. It takes trees, rivers, fences, and flowers. Why would it attack such benign objects? We took items at will until the antivirus program appeared and fought it off the attacks. It ain't worked for a while, but the virus has gotten stronger. I kind of, I don't want really, kind of want to buy stuff in it. I did like the first time around where I was like just messing about for just a few seconds in here. I'm gonna just save up. Lance gave us the work of his masters a long time ago. Now he is the master. He is the creator of his own world. Now as much is over, as he built this world to maintain it. Not us so much. When the world around you is crumbles, it only makes sense to move in with The world outside will inevitably fail you. But here's the same from main day. There's company. Huh. Pickpocket, hover pack, water boots, x-ray goggles. Hmm. Wonder what that does. Well, like I have a new skill now. Hmm. Welcome to Millenville. This is where my real life is. The only home anyone can ever truly have is the home they build within. My task, like the others, was to run simulations for possible human development on this planet. We don't even know where we are. The thousands of years, like thousands of light years away from Earth, perhaps. Each of us was designed by a different team of scientists. Hopefully each of us would, would have different simulations and different ideas. And they gave us the most advanced intelligence that the technologies could allow. We need to be able to think on our own to accommodate in predictable circumstances. They may have been our downfall, however. Humans should know that the more intelligence we, you dispose on a creature, the more futile life seems. I was the realist. I wanted my simulation to be exact. I couldn't falsely create anything. I wouldn't falsely create anything. I started from scratch down to the simulated miners mining simulated ore. I spent years laboring and watched a generation of robotic miners come and go. The ruins surrounding us outside. It took me far too long to realize the truth at all. You are here. You exist for the sole purpose of fighting the inevitable reality that the world that created you wants to kill you. Stop fighting the fight and join us. The virus? I can only imagine it will have something new with the never-ending efforts of the other dairy. When I cease their efforts, I'll feel that the virus would disappear. If you still wish to find it out, I sense it in an underground tunnel. I found the item under attack by the virus. It's underground mines. I've marked it for you. You'll be able to see it when, when you go down. I'll also give me access to the other three simulations so you can come up. And go as you please. Spend as much time as you need powering up before a fight. Every simulation has a neat way to make yourself stronger. Save up chips, which recommends system resources, and spend them however you wish to make yourself give yourself a better chance. There are many friendly pieces of code that will help you locate these resources in many different ways. I have a lot of virus combat simulator made. I recommend you visit to get familiar with the battle commands and the strategy. I also check with the status console in the control room from time to time to see the current power level of lint increments, threat levels, and system resource types. Good luck. Alright, so do I need to like go back down there to like do what I need to do?
Was that the virus? That's it, some sort of data in the spot that virus wants. So I'm going over here and press down to confront virus. Virtual version of Alpha, Bio, Omega, uh, Beta, Bio, Omega, Murad, and Milan will help you in a fight. You have to formulate strategies and abilities to defeat the virus. I hope that I can actually do this. Okay, what what's that do? Okay. <laughs> well, darn. I actually did it too fast. might be a mistake to like go to this level right now. <laughs> going on with those. Hello. I've only been here a few moments, but it feels like home. I feel very weak, though. Maybe I should sit down. Critical hit. Huh. What's this do? I don't know what I just did. Hello, find me. I want to show you something. Um, is this here still? 
from though you came and the dot you will turn. Oh no. Hello there, spirit. You don't mind if I call you spirit, do you? After all, that's not really your body, is it? You're only inhabiting it. You're not you're not so different from the humans. Hope that the people you encounter on the way here didn't frighten me. I've tried to create individuals to inhabit my simulation, but they never last. I simply don't have enough resources to dedicate enough process about each individual. In individual. They look around, speak a few words, and disappear into the code again. Again, not so long as humans, rising from nothing, living up brief and business, and then return to the dust. Why are you expecting them to find when you enter my simulation? It's true that we were programmed to simulate how humans might populate this planet, but that was a very long time ago. My designs have gone beyond that. My bet it wants to recreate the human race. I know that's impossible. I would like to think that it's still out there somewhere, men flesh than in the spirit. I cannot deny my program. I have designed a human to be here. I have created a reservoir of memories, a quiet and celestial haven for whatever may be left of them. Hope that if I create just a few similar individuals, maybe someday one will appear that I did not create, a real person in whatever form they might take. Perhaps this is what we are experiencing now with the virus. I think the virus is alive. I think it's a living being, an intelligent being. I will not resist it. Perhaps the virus is here to show us a new form of existence. The solution for us, measure in an afterlife we did not have anticipated, it is here now. It's seeking something. Found in black, the item I'm attacking here is it's down the very first water hole. Go see what you can find. Uh, nope. This is definitely like one of those. I could probably like you know get the hover thing. Yeah, this simulation is definitely like not one I don't want to actually mess with. I probably should exit this one. Yes, yes, yes. We're on Lunas and Finis. It's almost night time. You've been in the night phase. I recommend you take time to leave the station through the central. Uh, blah, I skipped too fast. These are derelicts scattered around the surface. The, there are derelicts scattered across the surface. Derelicts have taken interest in collecting things. Just another strange side effect being here so long. Try to find items of different kinds and live in the derelicts. Those will earn no trust and they'll dedicate more resources to your cause. That in turn will make them stronger next time you need help against the virus. I love how we're just like wandering around as an actual coffee cup. <laughs> well, coffee uh, maker. Do I need, like, a light or something? What in the world? I must just... Mm, I'm just gonna wander. Maybe I'll just find something for pressing left. I'm just hoping... Oh, what is that? Oh. Uh, yeah. I'm hoping there's no like element of like I lose all my items if I like wander too far or something. Because uh, this is kind of peaceful, really. It's, it's nice. You know that that planetoid over there is kind of. Mm, I'm hoping that that's not Earth or something. Wait, what? Yes, 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 whatever. Uh, 
upload them for you. They should be available the next time you enter some Maybe I should, yeah, give this to someone first. Is there anything I can do for you? Hmm. I'm gonna like, hopefully, I guess give it to this guy. Oh. Well, I better like, quickly go get the other part right quick before it's too late to like go get it. I'm gonna like try to power myself up in like that other part. I'm just like hoping that, you know, everything kind of goes alright. Um, buy better collect seeds. Oh. Sure. Can, can I actually give it to him? So here's the thing, like, I don't know, like, their names. I don't know who's who. Um, wait, who's, who's this one? Okay, so who wants this? Huh, nice. Another snow globe. You're always nice to me. I'll dedicate more resources helping you out from now on. Alright, let's try to like. So that's how they level up. I should probably like do battle sims after this. Like, cause I, I'm not really currently feeling the combat in a sense. I'm, I'm hoping that's not her freight later. <laughs> oh, wait. Yeah, sure. So, yeah, my main objective is just, like, dash, 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 and try to, like, find as much material as possible as quickly as possible. Ah, uh, yeah. Return to station. Yes, yes, yes. Blah, blah, blah. Let me get, let me get in. Cool. Alright. Alright, I can give this to this guy. Nice. My only hope is, like, for Battle Sims, it lets you, like, have a kind of a limited time to actually mess with it. Because in this particular case, it's just so... Like, the combat is... What the? Flying flip? What is this nonsense? Oh, crap. Is it actual Martians?
actually know what I want to do. that was good or not that's the thing i feel just stop just get me in the game wait crap i forgot about that system status 14 days left of power oh so like this is really time sensitive isn't it then I definitely don't know what like Junction Boy does. Thank <laughs> you. 
Actually, could like that's probably like the best way to like earn a lot of money, even though it'll take a while. But just like grind in there. Okay, this is entertaining. I still don't know like what the pickpocket does. Oh, 
Well, nothing here. That's kind of sad, really. But, you know, at the very least, we'll actually be fully... Oh, no. Do we, like, recover health? I'm not sure. like an awkward between like five and four. Oh no! Not that.
simulation and time simulation. <laughs> Very good. So about ten more. And at the very least we'll have finally have enough for like all of the add-on components. Power source time that will take just 15 days, like, well, you know, so. Well, now you can have It's very leery. That's like Majora's Mask kind of leery kind of feeling to it. And, like, I don't like that one bit. I, I just need to use like rapid trigger for this game. But there is like a limit to like the speed because after a while like it um uh, it does pause out. So even with Rapture, there would still be some sort of limit. Of course, my only kind of annoyance is like, uh, I, I guess that's a virus or something? Let me check it. Oh no. It's 900. I misread. Oh no. Let's give getting rid of the virus a try. Um. This is very tempting. Probably gonna have to like grind so I can just get all the upgrades. As much as I don't want to do that. And I still don't like know what the actual um, that upgrade for pickpocketing does. At the same time, I don't want to look it up. At the same time, I very much do want to look it up. Just 
inspire freelance? No, it doesn't. So, nope, hey, he still does. Crap. Give it a shot.
man. Oh! Oh wait, once per battle? Oh no. idea. I got a very interesting idea. Let me see here. Let me see. Uh, um, let me see. Yes. Mm -hmm. I think this is just the thing I need. I can't believe I'm doing this in one well, in one sense I do, because cheese. Yes, 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 whatever. Come on, come on, come on. I like pressing the escape button for some reason. Yes, 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 yes. Come on, come on. <laughs> yes, yes. Crap. 
It's a way to like extend the days because in this like case it's really kind of frustrating that there's only like 15 day and night cycles so you have to like get through these boss pretty quick unless you want to have a bad time but I don't know like what exactly would happen once them actually um, the days are up in this particular case and I'm actually kind of surprised they don't like have solar panels or something. Hmm. Very peculiar. Hopefully I wasn't missing anything while I was kind of... <laughs> a toy person. <laughs> Holding down the left button so I can collect all the treasures. I really hope, like, uh, those Martians don't show up again. Well, yeah, you know, I'm... Because it just came out of nowhere. I was really surprised with it. Oh, brother. Let's see. More treasure for me? Yes. Enough of that. I know. Just let me in. Or at least this time I'll like know exactly who to go to this time. I really 
should like see if they have like any um, flavor text. Okay, no flavor text, unfortunately. I was hoping for something pretty interesting, you know. Let's see about this. Fourteen days left of power. Like, if I eliminate the virus in, like, a certain place, does it actually give me some sort of, like, boost or something? I'm finding more stuff. Yeah. I must say, like, this observatory looks pretty good. I almost kind of want to see what this, like, flavor text is on the screen. Because it looks like maybe it's, um... Oh, wait. Ice messed up, unfortunately. So I'm not even wondering about that one. Like, how did that one even move around? If it is, I'm probably gonna like run out of time like outside. But I might I might be able to grab one treasure. <laughs> Martians again. Alright, let's hurry up. Is it because the virus is, like, burning more, like, power than usual or something? Oh, nice. I actually retained these bonuses. Like, uh, boost that I got from those actual level ups, I'll be able to, like, 
finally take down all those actual virus pieces or whatever. Oh, this is gonna be good. kind of like problem is like I feel like it's probably gonna like respawn if I just like just go ahead so I can just go for it. Okay top priority. We've saved a piece of data from the virus until we discover what the virus wanted with this. Crypto and store it somewhere safe. I decode what this data block contains. It seems to be a tree. That's not your job. Your job is to protect the information. If the virus wanted it, then it must be important, right? I was just expecting it to be attacking something more crucial. Very well. I'll be ready when the virus targets another item. You knew that. I hate to start from scratch all again with another one of you. Like, what does he mean by that? Or they, or whatever. Is there like another virus in here? I have a dear item the virus target. I need you to talk with Malik so I can tag it for you. Oh, 
Sir, thank you for saving small me from my simulation. I never liked to ignore the virus poses a threat to everything I created. Fortunate reminder, there is no escape from Gunner's reality. Wound that for you can find you where you have to kill you. Despite your efforts, the virus still managed to rip something from my simulation. I'm not sure what it is, I just sense that it's not. Even the harder you try to find the more damage you'll save more deals, it seems to be matching your effort, which doesn't matter my theory of leaving me alone. I'll send something in the satellite. I sense that somewhere our network is connected to a biological organism, so there's no doubt BioBeta and his bizarre experiment. Uh, Locate item. The virus is attacking. I flagged it for you. It's right here in Malinville. Oh. Well, that's convenient. Wall, sucker.
A Dutch library had become a file again. It seems that the item was a swing set. Strange job for a computer badge to attack. Things I always had seen may have been a swing set in simulation, but it may contain other data that somehow is useful to the virus. Kind of makes me wonder if I should like go into the other simulations or not. Let me actually go to bio betas right quick. Where's bio beta? Oh, it's like in the front row. Virus next target. Speak with Bio Beta. This will give me other things I'd like to do. I'll do future mankind. It's working progress, but I think it's not bad. It's not sort of having a human evolution. Like earlier, I realized my mission was to run some motion projects for future human development of this planet. The time changed everything, doesn't it? I haven't heard anything earlier for decades. We don't know their status or location. My theory is that they can kill something. Devices. And my folks shift from how the green humans here and recreate new and certainly improved human race. Someone on this station is really unfair, realistic. Men work with developing biological specimens of them to grow organic material. However, I was mainly able to master a developed mind. So I'm not entirely to blame for this. One of the biological samples missing is missing recently. When the station was first created, Earth settlement on and studied the science box. They came on a regular basis carrying material for analyzation and detection of their simulations. Many were of poor quality, having been used for other purposes. And suddenly one day the science spot stopped. For several months we heard nothing from Earth, but then the other pops started to rise. Pods full of photographs, artwork, toys, books, we had later in the landscape. That was used for our research. I don't understand what the human expect us to do with it. For some they sent out, our only one accounted for it arrived and was scanned the database where it went missing. I'm sure you'll do everything you can to find a missing sample. I know you're on our side. Find sample 2174 is too late. Technology great hum humans only make sense. There are always unforeseen challenges. I was certainly here. It's attacking objects on the far side of the simulation. Try to find the second vertical corridor and check out where it goes. It's only temporary, so that's simply this place is happening to one second.
by the second vertical corridor. Let's check that out. Service, have you? Hmm. So obviously, apparently, it's on like the surface. I don't know.
crap, who actually does the alarm clocks again?
Here we go again. Crap. Darn it! I closed it right out. I keep on pressing the escape button. I can make it.
actually doesn't have any more time left, right? I wouldn't even think of like shooting walls, but I was gonna like, hmm. stop the stream for now like I like I hope they enjoyed it but for now I'm gonna like just be doing 